Hey guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe. So today I'm going to bring a haul that contains, what do we got? We have two bags of Shein, we have a couple things from Allie, not much, and then I have a couple other little finds that I got just at some local stores. So I did want to show you these little containers from Dollar Tree. Um, they're like this, I've already taken one of their package, not the gel of course. But this is exactly what it is. It comes like this. They're like a dollar. Now what I've done is I've just like, um, how you call it? Sticky tape, double-sided sticky tape them so they all stick up. I've chosen to do four for my, um, how many I do? My height. And then I put, this one I've just put my little Savvy Land gels in because I really don't want them, the color gels. I just don't want them in my custom gel drawer and I don't really have a lot of other colored gels so I figured they can just live there and the other one is stationary. So I have eight in total that I got for them. When I do a little area tour you'll see them a little bit more in depth. Okay um few things I did get a couple more of these binders. As you see guys, look, I got them for $5. They're from Michaels. They were in the clearance section. Guys, don't skip out on that clearance. Yeah, so I'm going to use these for... I do I do have another one that I use for my stamping plates. So I do intend on putting my stamping plates in these two. And that should be plenty of room. I do have these little... I don't know, whatever you call these little guys. I actually found them at Crazy Bins. Um... That's a hit or a miss if you're ever going to find anything there. Um, but I don't know, to be honest, they're kind of annoying when they close. They don't really close that well. But I'm going to use them for my bigger stamping plates. And I did order some of these from Shein. I want to see how they work. I also ordered this little shelf from Shein, guys. Um, I'll just have to insert a picture of that. Um, it's really cute. I just actually Mac tacked it the same color as this. Little marble. Just to give me a little bit more storage on my side. Um, okay, speaking of crazy bins, um, I don't know if you guys have a place like that. It's basically just Amazon returns or like other store returns. So I did find a couple little things from there. So I just want to show you guys quick. I found these nail tips. Not bad. Just some kind of short um, square. Can't go wrong with that. I think I paid like $3 for the stuff that I'm showing you from Crazy, so pretty reasonable. I just got, I seen these little Fimos. I know it's a little past Halloween, but you know what, they're good for next year for 3 bucks. Like, you just can't go wrong, right? And they even got these foils. So I think they're pretty cute. These I can probably open. Oh my gosh, and they're all shut. Well, nobody's done anything tampered with them or anything like that. They're still perfectly good. Like we all return stuff that is perfectly good. We just didn't think it was what we wanted. Yeah, so. They're quite a bit, actually. Yeah. So I don't know the brand. It doesn't really have a brand or anything on it, but. I thought they were really cute. Like I said, can't go wrong for the price. Oh, I did get these little glitters too. I just have them over here because I don't want them to spill everywhere. And I have to do a organize with me glitter because I tell you guys, I have glitter coming out of my, you know what I'm saying. So these little guys, I just got them. I will probably do a mix because you know me and know my pot. So I'm thinking I'll just kind of mix them up a little bit and kind of customize these little guys. And then these ones, I think, like I said, I think I got all of them for like three bucks or something. Oh, and I seen these little things. I did like um, put them in a different bag. The bag was kind of ripped. I don't know what I'm going to use them for. They're just mermaid tails, but I don't know. Sorry, guys. I just shook you. I don't, I don't know. It's extra. It's very, very extra. But can you imagine? Just put that on your nail. Maybe not as permanent, but like, even using that little double-sided adhesive that we do for press-ons. Just for like, if you're going out and you just want a statement, or just for like, some pics. I don't know guys, like I said, they were like, 
next to nothing for them and I just thought they were super cute. Whether I'll ever use them or maybe I'll just make a under the sea set and have it as an accent just for like display, who knows. But I thought it was cute. Oh, and I got these stickers. I'm not gonna, am I gonna open them? All right, I'll open them. I won't take them out of their other packages though. Yeah, so I got these there as well, but they're all Halloween. Like I said, I'm have them for next year. But yeah, guys, all these stickers for like dollars. Right? I wonder if they glow in the dark. They kind of give me like they do glow in the dark. Ow. I don't know. I have to really see under the light for a second. But you get some really cute stickers. Oh guys, they do glow. You're not going to be able to see that. But they do. So that's awesome. Yeah, so they are more Halloween themed. But... Like I said, you don't have to do it for Halloween. If you're just in a pumpkin mood, put a pumpkin on you. These are like those little faces. Really cute. Yeah, so I got like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine packs of stickers. Like I said, for I think like three bucks. Alright guys, that was all the little gems that I found at that little local store that I have. Let's move on to some, I think Alley. I think we're good for Alley. Yeah, let's just go Alley. So these are all the same. I'm just going to take out one. If I recall correctly, I think that they were like 30 grams. I'll have to double check. But these are just pots. And it did take me a little bit to find the double walled pots for gel. Um, because you know that you have to put your gel in a specific container because it will cure. Right, so my idea behind this is I love buying the bigger um, Benelises, but to have an eight ounce jar sitting on my desk when I am tr working and just, it's, it's a lot, right? Like my area is already kind of tight and I don't like the cluster. So my idea is to put these in smaller jars for when I work out of them. So yeah, I think I got like eight of them if I'm correct. Let me just check. I actually don't remember if it was six or eight. So that's four. Yeah, I got eight guys. So they will come in handy. I will probably end up ordering a few more of these. I really actually like the size of them. They're pretty good. I was kind of scared that they'd be too small. But they're not bad at all. So that was a good find. And then I got one of these little water pens. Because, I don't know how to get them off. Oh. Okay, well that looks kind of messed up. It feels weird. I do have this um, water um, set that I've never really used. Um, so I want to give it a go. I just wanted to get an extra pen. But this pen does not look that good, to be honest. I did think I did order some of these from Shein as well, but yeah, that's not as small as I thought it would be. So, eh. It wasn't a different package, but it kind of ripped, so I just took it out. And we have some gems. I'm just going to move this stuff off. One second. And grab a container. Sorry, I should have been a wee bit more prepared. I'm so surprised that these actually came as early as they did. I didn't order these that long ago. I will show you a couple of them. But these are so, so beautiful. They have like an etched um, like rim around them. I think I got one in every color that they offered. Um, you get ten in a pack. So I will take one out. 
And guys, I haven't put anything away from my last hauls. Um, I've just been super busy. So I have an extremely long and large, I meant to say large, but it will be long, um, organized with me coming up after this. I was just gonna, I was gonna do that, but then I was like, you know what, I do have a few things. I might as well just show you guys and then do it all one time. I did just put out a little DIY um, art piece that I did for the side of my desk for some pictures and stuff of roses. If you haven't, guys, go check that out. That The roses I did just get in with the alley stuff. I did have the link. The link is over there in that video. So, guys, go check that out. It turned out super cute. I'm actually really impressed. I like it. So, these are some spinners. I think I got, yeah, I got five of them. Um, they have these on Shein as well. I just wanted to see if Ali, um size was any different. And to be honest, I don't think they are. When I do the organize with me, I'll double check. We'll see when we put these away. Because I'll put them in the same container if they're the same size. But to be honest, they do look the same. So it's kind of a bummer because I think that they were still a couple dollars each. So I was like, I don't think I really saved anything by doing it like this. Not 100% sure. Um, these bees, I thought they kind of give me like Gooch vibes. So I got these for when I do some Gooch nails. You know me and Gucci. Yeah, like don't they have a little Gooch vibe? I feel like they do. Probably shouldn't have ripped that package. Oh, and these ones are a little different. I'll just set it in here. That's, oops. Actually, let me put that on my hand. Because I'm going to tell you right now, that's going to stick up. The wings are going to stick up. Let's see. That is super pretty, though. But yeah, guys, it's going to stick up. But it's cute. Like I said, I usually in here all of my... Rhinestones like these, these type of gems. I mean, um, with poly gel. I find that that works best for me. So you can do it with acrylic. Um, I think the glue, unless you get a good thick one, I don't think it's gonna um, adhere that well. But that's just my opinion. Oops. Super cute. So these ones are a little smaller. But again, they're gonna the, the weight the wing span is going to stick out quite a bit. Come on, focus. It's like it doesn't want to focus on this because there's too much sparkles. No. Are you gonna do it? Maybe. I don't know, like, what is going on? I feel like my phone has been, like, it doesn't want to focus correctly. Maybe I have it, like, maybe I hit a wrong setting or something. Oh, guys, I thought this was super neat. So I got this for my stamping, um, my stamping thing. A stamping tool. Ugh. Probably try to speak after I do all that. So I use one of these, right? Like your standard um, lint brush thing, and I just keep it on like this. But this guy holds it. Oh, sorry. I don't know, I just a bit thought it was a cute little container. Obviously you can replace these, but just to have that more on the side of my desk like this instead of just having like this old little basic guy. I thought it was kind of cute. And like I said, you just refill them with them anyways, right? So And um, they do come in black as well where I seen this one. 
but as you guys know, they're kind of pink and blue. I think they only had pink and black, to be honest. Ew. And I thought that was going to come off nice and clean. So nasty. Alright, well that's going to have to get put to the side and I'll have to wipe that down with some alcohol. Okay, let's put this up so I don't slice the finger off. Get that little tape off me. Okay, we got some more rhinestones. Oh, those are really pretty. Like I said, guys, when I do the organize with me, you'll see all these way in uh, in more depth. So pretty. And guys, all of these rhinestones that I'm showing you, I've been buying the glass rhinestones. I find it's kind of like the next best thing to the Swarovskis. At least that's my opinion. I don't know, I, I haven't been able to really find Swarovski. Somebody tried to send me a link or something, but for whatever reason, I feel like I'm not, I don't get all my messages on YouTube. So I feel like I should probably ask that same person if they can just put it into my Insta message. Like, those are gorgeous. Mmm, so pretty. And last but not least, these have a little bit of a two-tone, the kind of yellowy gold and purple. So pretty. Oh, okay. So this is glitter. Guys, oh, you know what? Here. I just don't want to have glitter everywhere right now. I will have glitter everywhere when the time comes, if you know what I'm saying. So those are really pretty. Um I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm not sure if this came in a set or if I just bought every single one. I'd have to actually look into it. It kind of, like, it, to me it looks like it, it comes in a set. Here you have your finer glitter, you have some tinsel glitter. So these are really festive. You have some nice reds, burgundies, pinks, golds, mixture of gold and silver. A little bit of more of like the champagne-ish. It's a little bit lighter gold and then a good gold there. Really pretty. So that will be some of the glitters that we will have to put away. And then this, I was like, what is this? It's so heavy. I don't know. I thought it was like liner gels or something. I got so excited and then I opened it. And it is files. So I ordered quite a few files on the 11 sale. Um, I think I saved a little bit of money, like 4 or $5, so it was quite good. Um, you guys know that I like to use, what was a little gift? Thank you, seller. Um, I like to use the metal base file. So it has a metal base, and then you have your sticky, and you just put it on it. Just like that. Well, take the plastic off, but you know what I'm saying. And guys, I find that like with this, it's a lot easier to sterilize it. Um, but it's just more sturdy. It doesn't bend like how the regular file bends. So I really like the concept of the metal file, to be honest. So yeah, um, it's a little annoying that the seller never marks them. Like that's one thing I'm not a fan of. That is the second time I think I bought from this person and they're not marked. But for the most part, I know that I ordered 180 and 240. 
like that I can tell just by touching it that that is a 180 so I'll just basically I'll have to touch and see but I got two of each oh I lied three well, actually, I don't know if I got two of each. What I did look up was two of each, but they must have added one in. And I think the reason um, I did get one extra is the metal parts. Um, I don't know why. I don't, I don't know if I couldn't find just the metal or I just chose to might as well just get the metal and files. Like files are not going to go to waste. Um, but I needed the individuals for my kits. And guys, I did do that today. I got in. Let me just show you quick. So I got in these nippers from Shein and I knew that they were in there so I just took them all out. Um, I had a little time so I took them all out of the packages today and I sterilized them and then I put them all into my packages. So now I have, I think I have eight now because I had two. But these ones as you see, I didn't have enough of these hard files. Like I said, I got these in, I want to say, well, I did these today. These hard files and stuff, guys, I didn't get that until later on um, today. So I guess it was my timing that when my mail came. But this is what I mean. I usually have the metal file already sanitized, sterilized, and put in these packages. But I do have some that don't have them yet. So fine for now once i when i open them i will just sterilize all these but when i open them i'll just use that and then next time they'll be put in like this so that's it that's my jam and you guys i think i've showed you guys how i store my files in my drawer there is a did i do an organize i think i did a restock and you see how i do my files so go check out that video guys it goes a little bit more in depth on how i do all that Okay, put that to the side. So guys, I'm gonna do both sheen bags and I think because there's not really a lot of stuff. You know me, I usually or always order a lot, but the stuff that I got was actually bigger stuff. So I got some organizing stuff for my area. Like I said, I got this little stand, um, a few things like that. There is still some few, uh, few little trinkets and nail gems and some stuff like that, of course. Um, but it's more bigger, so I think I'm just going to dump both in the basket one time, and that's the way we're going to play this game today. So, number one. Um, you know what? I didn't even check to see how many items were in each of these. So, we're not going to do that today. We don't know how many items are in them, but I know there's not that that many, so we're just going to do both. Usually I write it down, but I didn't know I didn't. Sorry for that. Mm. Oh. So I'm gonna take out that. That's a big thing. And then that's a big thing. Holy. Okay. So that's it, guys. And those more files, which are opened, which is annoying. Okay. So I'm going to put this to the side. Shake of a lamb. Put that there. That there. Guys, remember this? It comes with a pillow. I got another one. Um. so loud I wasn't even gonna open it but I did anyways okay so I have two of these now and the reason for that mainly is for when my clients are over on my other side they can have one for each arm and kind of chill um how do I say like I have this right so this is my thing this is my actual armrest 
So you put your arm up, but I find that your elbow is kind of still leaning on the table and it's like the, at the edge of the table. And I find that uncomfortable for my own self. So I know if I'm a client, I'm in the other chair, like that's going to be sore on my arm or my elbow. So I just got these two. Well, I had got one originally, but then I realized they're just not big enough. So I just got two, one for each of their arm and that way they could sit more comfortable. The more comfortable they are, they're going to do what I want. <laughs> so they can kind of keep their arm there and not keep moving it. So that was my reason behind getting another one of these. And it's marble, so it matches this one that I have. This one I got from Ali. Very cute. And then the mats. Yeah, they're all right. I just mainly use them when I do like videos to be honest because I have such a glare okay well there's not really a glare right now on the bottom of that though so yeah enough rambling we can keep a pushing okay Sheen give me a thing they always give you these guys but there it is if you really want it um yeah okay I got this little can it's a little garbage can um I think it's a random pick I'm actually glad that they gave me blue though. I think I had blue, pink, and green. So really it, I had like a good chance of getting blue or pink. And you guys know that's my theme. So we would have been happy either way. I thought that it was just like small and cute with this little dude here. Like I said, I got some storage stuff. You know me guys, I'm really big on storage and I wanted to have everything have a home and just get more storage. I find that my stuff, like how I have my stuff, if I can elevate it to have two levels and things like that, like that's my jam. Um, okay. All honesty. Well, it's a cheap little garbage can. Do you know what I mean? Like it's whatever, it'll do. Right, I do have this, is what I usually actually was using, which is just a tin oh, from the Dollarama, um, which is fine, but I don't know. I thought this one was just cute. I kind of want to use the tin as my little laundry basket, and it's just mainly for my little dust towels that go over my duster. I want to be able to wash them completely separate when I get my other ones, so... Okay, let's open up this. I think this is a, oh, I'm gonna slice my finger, oh. Yeah. So this is a lipstick holder, which I'm not gonna be using it for lipstick. But I was thinking, which is super cute, did not come broken, so I'm very happy with that. But I was thinking either leave it on its side like this, or it could be up. Um, I think I might get another one. I just wanted to get one to see how it was. They do have a different size of a bigger one as well. Um, to put my liner. Like my liner um, polishes in. Or just those small um, other ones. Do I have an example? Like here's an example. Right? I could go there. Those ones are a little bit smaller, but you kind of get my drift of what I was thinking. So that's what that is for. And I'll see if how I like that, or if that works for me, or if it just doesn't, then it just doesn't, right? But I think there were like, I don't know, guys, it's Shein. I can get the price if you really want it, but I'm not going to be listing all of these. Little tabs. I think I'm good for tabs. Like, I have so many tabs now. I went tab crease. Um, just some files. I know I just said I, I really only use my other ones. I do, but I didn't know when they were going to come in. So I just wanted to have a backup. And I swear every time I do that, I think I had like, let's get a backup for something. Because I have it on the way from Ali, but I don't know how long it's going to take. I did that with some of my other implements. And then they both show up at the same time. I got another one of these. I do want to put alcohol in one. I have one for RDF for um, my wipe solution, but I wanted another one for alcohol. Okay, so some fun stuff. I did still have little gems in here. I knew that. I just didn't have a lot. So, oh, these are the perfume bottles. Um, I don't think I had these ones. I did already haul the ones that had the little pink gems inside. 
So I'll take these out for the peeps who hadn't seen. But if you guys go back and look, you will see those in another haul. Oops. Don't. So cute. I wonder if I can get that out to show you guys. I got this thing. Um, it's actually for your tweezers. I found it at Crazy though, so, so I don't know. You probably get it on Amazon. That's really what they're for. So, but it has a top. And then your tweezers go in it, and it's marble, and it just matches as I grab these ones. So, I thought that was kind of cool, to be honest. Yeah, I've gotten a lot of little good um little goodies from my local places okay some black swatch sticks some of the white ones already on this little thing um the only real reason i got the white is just so i don't have to paint the nail white when i want to use inks and stuff just for practicing they're not necessarily like to put on i guess if you just want a quick white set though they all look good. And you just break them off the little tabs, guys. And I like that they come in this little container, so that's just easy to store. I'm down for that. I did get the white swatches because I think I'm going to want to do a little bit of swatching on a few of my inks. Just as designs, I think I want to put some of my designs on my rings to hold them. I got these little hooks for to hold them. I think that is in here. So this is a gel brush, I believe. size just like acrylic guys you guys are going to want to clean your brush first before you use them get all that glue out of there it's really cute it has little rhinestones in it I like that got another one with the white rhinestones You know me guys, I really only use gel and poly gel products. I don't use acrylics, so I'm always down to find a good brush. Yeah, okay, this is a gel brush too. It just has the more straight edged. Can never go wrong with having extra brushes. And sometimes you just don't know when you're gonna find like that brush, right? I usually keep these things, but because those two have lids, um, I still might keep it for some other, um, brushes that I use. I like to keep them in that and that it really does protect them. Oh, well, let me show you this. This is some foils, but they're just the sheet foils. I think I've already hauled these, I think once but I think I messed up a couple of them <laughs> I'm lie, they're very like sensitive but I didn't really have any colored foils so I wanted to get a couple of them and I liked it see how easy they are to mess up um, I wanted to get the sheets and then that way they're flat until and well really until I touch them and then they're not flat anymore but guys, I do have more that I've already got. Um, I just put them in these little containers to keep them nice and safe. So as I have that, and I do have that right beside me in my foil and glitter drawer. Very convenient. Okay, let's try to run through this now. Um, some dental bibs. Never go wrong with them. Um, I, oh, I use them. I run through them very fast, so... I always like to have a couple extra every few sheen runs I usually throw one in there and then and this actually had to happen that both of these bags had one each so I just go back and forth between the blue and pink and see which one I'm low on and then I just get so on and so forth 
another file. Like I said, guys, I usually use the other ones, but I did want to have a couple on hand just in case. These are little lollies. I thought these were just the cutest little things. They're quite small. What's well, kind of nice. Most of the lollies that I have are um, like the kawaii ones that are quite big. Oh my. There we go. But are they not just like everything? They kind of give me like a candy like vibe to them. But yeah, guys, they're very flat. Ow. These things are so sharp. So they are going to stick up. See? Kind of. I don't know why my phone does not want to focus. Alright, very nice. Alright guys, a couple more things. So I got some of these, I got one of each of these little bears. I'll take one out and show you guys. I think they all say smile on them. Why don't you want to focus today? There you go. Yeah, I thought they were kind of cute. Oh yeah, though. Oh gosh, they are pretty big. Yeah, so they're really cute, but yeah, they're gonna stick up quite a bit. Right. So they came in three different colors, and I just grabbed all three. I really like the the um the brightness of the yellow in the pink though. What else do we got? What else do we got? Oh, I got these black ones, and I have all the other colors. I don't know why I never got the black ones for some odd reason. So, as I kind of was going through some of my gems and rhinestones and all this great stuff, I realized that I didn't have the black ones. So they needed to be added. Out here. Okay, I thought maybe I had two of them. Another one of the lollies. Some white swatch sticks. We just have some metal chains. These are kind of like, well, there's like the black goldish vibes going there. Okay, I have these. Um, I think I have them in the other color, and I think I just wanted to grab one. I think I just grabbed one. I want to say I grabbed one. Not two. They're kind of just like half hearts. But they're just the plain diamond, they're not the AB. So they're just like the white diamond. That's it, guys. All more in depth when I do the organize with me. Got some sanding bits. No, they don't have what they are on them. That looks medium. I thought that looks more medium. That looks more coarse. So I did, guys, get another one of them. And then these things. Oh, hold on. We have, oh god, you know, I think I ordered these twice. I think they're in my last cart. So these are like a champagne bees. I actually didn't have any of the champagne ones. I got this wireless charger. Um, I don't know if it's going to work or not. I guess we'll find out and see. But I thought it would be good to have on my table. So that way if clients need to charge their phone. It's just there, good to go. But these are what I was actually so excited for. These are just little hooks. They're advertised as mask hooks. They're in like the car section. Car accessories. Um, in Shein. 
And my thought is what I want to do, if I can find it quickly. Okay. So on the side of my stand, um, I want to put these on the side. And then I want to put my Vanellisa swatch sticks on there. I can put um, my gel swatch sticks. So basically swatch sticks that I want to see that I have handy, but not necessarily my polish ones for my clients to pick out. So I'm going to put these on the side of my drawer. I just thought these were super cute. I really actually hope that works. I probably should have just tested them. Hmm. Okay, that does look through. Perfect. So that was my only fear, and that works out great. So yeah, like a little bling. How can you go wrong with that? So I got four of them. And then I'm going to have one, I'm going to put one on the side there to hold my, um, my little apron as well. But they're cute. I'll probably get more of these, to be honest. That's it, guys. Basket is empty. We are done. Thank you guys so, so much for all the love and support. I truly, truly appreciate it. You guys are amazing. If you haven't, go ahead and hit that subscribe. If you enjoyed, give it a thumbs up. And thank you guys so, so much. If you guys have anything, questions, anything like that, just let me know in the comments, and I'll be sure to get back to y'all. All right, guys. Bye.